Good morning everyone, this is Anthony, July 6th, 2016. It's about uh, 6.54 a.m. on this uh, beautiful, hot, and steamy morning. What I'm doing this morning is uh, my Goal Zero Yeti 400 battery was getting a little low. So what I'm doing is I have two of my Boulder 15 solar panels linked together with the uh, clips one here and one at the bottom which I actually couldn't push through all the way but uh, at any rate the panels are still together and um, the Sun is coming up now I'm gonna set these panels in the Sun and we're gonna do a test on to see how long it takes to uh, top off my battery so once the Sun comes up and I get these panels out in the full Sun we'll see where the battery level is and um, we'll see how long it takes to top off with the two Boulder 15s. So basically these are just uh, the Boulder panels you can link together. So right here I've got one daisy chain to the other and then the uh, cord from that one running to the input on the uh, Yeti 400 battery. Um, so the battery is going to stay on board in the uh, Stealth van this morning while I um, while I uh, charge the panels and keep them outside so they'll be outside the van just like that and the battery will stay inside and I'll shut the doors and uh, we should be good to go so let's get this set up in the Sun and then uh, we'll see what it looks like all right guys there's a shot of my panels I got them angled towards the Sun as the Sun rises here uh, this morning and then we'll take a look inside the van and see if they, uh, as soon as they begin collecting power and transferring it to the battery. Let's see how that's working out. All right, it's uh, 7.01 a.m. You can see the panels have started collecting uh, or kicked on the, showing me that they're working. The power uh, is low on watts on the Gold Zero. There we are there. So we're going to mark the time at 7.01 a.m. Now let's just call it 7 a.m. today. And uh, we'll leave these panels out and we'll come back periodically and check on the, um, the battery as it uh, collects, uh, as the panels collect power from the sun. So basically my panels are about, uh, you know, five or six feet away from the battery I've got them just leaned against the bucket here and there they are I'll just set them once I lock my truck up I'll set them out here for a few hours as the Sun moves I'll just move them and come out and move them around periodically so we should start seeing that uh, battery charge up <clears throat> okay so we have 30 watts Two panels or 30 watts, two Boulder 15s topping off our battery. Hopefully, uh, we'll see how long it takes, or at least get it up to, you know, above halfway, so I could begin using it. But we'll be back periodically today. All right, guys, it's 8:13 a.m. Since I put this on, you see the input here. We are getting really good sun right now so that battery is charging just give you a shot here okay we'll come back in a few hours and uh, check out the status all right guys 9:33 a.m. see the input there Sun is still blaring. We're looking good. Okay, guys, it's 12:43 p.m. <clears throat> Checking on our charging here. Can't tell if you can see this or not. Let's unplug it and see where we are. So we are about halfway 
So we got a bar with the charging so far. So let's shut this and keep this on till the end of the day and see how everything works out. Let's see if we can get another bar before uh, four o'clock. Hey guys, it's uh, 4 p.m. <clears throat> we just took the panels off. I'm gonna turn this on just so you guys could see. So I had them on since seven this morning. <clears throat> Got about half a charge, half a uh, full line. I didn't move the panels around as much as I should have to track the sun, but at any rate, we did get some charging in and um, we'll continue tomorrow and uh, take it from there. But just testing out my gear and tomorrow I may add a third panel to make it 45 watts and see if that boosts it a little bit more. We'll give it another shot tomorrow. Stay ready, guys.